Freight trains actually belong on every model railroad layout. In the days of the Deutsche Bundesbahn, many classes were used not only to haul passenger cars, but also heavy loads of freight. One of them was the 221, one of the most famous diesel locomotives ever. Now it appears at Märklin in the once a very popular ocean blue ivory color scheme. But today, this color scheme is very much in vogue again. Ich glaube, damals Mitte der 70er und Anfang der 80er Jahre, da war das sicherlich eine Farbgebung, die nicht ganz so toll angekommen ist. I think back then in the mid 70s, early 80s, it was certainly a color scheme that didn't go down so well. But when we see the locomotives today and also the models for them, I think that this color scheme already has returned to a bit of cult status. It was only in use for a short time on the Deutsche Bundesbahn. And when you look at the locomotives today, they actually look very interesting. The engine is presented in operating conditions circa 1984, era 4. All four axles are driven by carden shafts. A controlled high-efficiency drive is centrally installed. The half o model has an MFX plastic holder on board and promises many interesting actions in freight service thanks to the new telex coupler that can be switched front and rear. Other features include the shunting double A-light function and digitally activatable cab and engine room lighting. There is an X-Works locomotive engineer figure in driver's cab 1. This colorful car set consists of a total of five models, all loaded with containers. It goes excellently with the 221. The two axle box cars have reproduced heavy-duty buffer planks and inserted handles. The 4 axle car has a prototypical open-work metal floor. DC operators can obtain appropriate exchange wheel sets from their specialist dealer. The 221 was a superstar on the rails in eras 3 and 4, but in era 6 the Vectron has started dominating the scene. So it's no wonder that another model of the DB Vectron may roll right into the assortment at Maglin and Trix. Für Siemens das Erfolgsprodukt. Es kam letzte Woche die Meldung, dass der 1500. Vectron The most successful product for Siemens. Last week the 1500 Vectron was sold. The operators seem to be satisfied with the locomotive because people keep buying it. You see them at the big government run railroads like Deutsche Bahn AG, but also many private ones use the Vectron for their freight transport within Europe. As befits a freight locomotive, the Hafo Vectron weighs heavily on the track thanks to its die-cast zinc chassis and superstructure. Together with the controlled high-performance drive, four driven axles and traction tires, the miniature Vectron should be able to handle even long-model freight trains. In order for it to be able to travel across borders, it is equipped with the shunting light for the Netherlands and Switzerland as well as the wrong way signal for Italy and Switzerland. These lights can each be switched separately digitally. Every model railroader is sure to have freight cars to go with the Vectron in his or her collection because there are numerous vehicles in the Märklin assortment. However, another new freight car has appeared to go with the Vectron. It is a vehicle from the suit of 19.9 meter cars in operating condition as of 2010 that can be used for many loads. Fine movable stakes, aluminum sidewalls and a metal insert that provides good running characteristics distinguish the car. A variant with a different car number will be released by Trix. Fitting for era 4, a GBKL-type boxcar will roll into the assortment as a not mended type private car. A car that should be a good fit for mixed freight trains of that era. Finally, two early era 3 milk cars appear, operating condition in the late 1940s. The two Bavarian built cars are from the first delivery from 1908 and still have DR lettering. Grove-type fans have been reproduced on the flat roofs. There is an attached stairway at one end of each car. For friends of the Swiss railroad, there will be a res-stake car loaded with a gravel replica. 
To match this, a variant of the popular Robel will be released, whose loading crane can be controlled digitally. The model reflects the operating condition as of 2019 and has the colors of the track construction company Zelsa AG.